This video explains how to administer a vaccine intradermally or into a shallow skin layer in different places on the body. Intradermal administration of a vaccine is usually done in the forearm. If the patient is concerned about having a mark on their forearm, the upper back below the shoulder blade or the skin over the upper arm in the deltoid area can be used. We will first demonstrate administration at the forearm site and then review administration in other places on the body. First, clean the site on the forearm where you will do the injection. While pulling the skin taut, position the needle with a bevel facing up and insert the needle at a 5 to 15 degree angle into the skin, staying very shallow to keep the needle tip in the dermis. The dermis is a skin layer about 1 to 4 millimeters thick, or about the thickness of a piece of cardboard. Slowly inject 0.1 milliliters into the dermis. This is known as an intradermal injection. This will often create a pale bump, or wheel, as the skin rises. A wheel does not always appear. There's no need to repeat the dose if a wheel does not appear. If the patient is concerned about receiving the vaccine on their forearm, they can be vaccinated in the upper back below the shoulder blade or the skin over the upper arm in the deltoid area. Clean the skin of the upper back for injection, then pull the skin taut and insert the needle at a 5 to 15 degree angle. Slowly inject 0.1 milliliters of vaccine. The procedure is the same for the skin over the upper arm in the deltoid area. Clean the skin for injection, then pull the skin taut and insert the needle at a 5 to 15 degree angle. Slowly inject 0.1 milliliters of vaccine. Safely dispose of the needle and perform hand hygiene after completing the injection. Observe all patients for at least 15 minutes after vaccination to watch for a potential allergic reaction. Observe them for 30 minutes if they have a history of severe allergy or anaphylaxis to a vaccine ingredient including gentamicin, ciprofloxacin, chicken, or egg. 